Hello everyone, this is Calvin Wade again. Um, this time I have created something that is really helpful. Um, this has helped me a ton. It's a work queue. Um, this is how it works. First of all, uh, you put in what you need to do. Here's something that's on my to-do list. Okay. <clears throat> when you uh, just tab over, you can see that it creates a checkbox and it also tells what date it is requested, which is today's date. And then here you can put uh, whoever requested it, or you can put some kind of organization around that. Um, here's another item. Okay. And so now, what's cool about this is that um, it'll automatically add items down below here, so it's naturally sorted from uh, oldest to newest just by the way you enter things in. If you put a date that it's due, so let's put May 3rd, um, then this is just a way to keep track of it. If it just so happens that the due date is tomorrow, though, <coughs> then it will kind of highlight this line. And if it was due today, then it'll make it red. And if it's today or later, it'll stay red. One of the nicest parts about this is that um, I always lose emails. When you have so many things going on and you have a ton of email, um, this allows you to keep your emails in a location. So you click here and it tells you, please uh, select the request that it belongs to. So it'd be whatever one you want to put it on. And so I'll just use that one. And then it opens up a, dia a file dialog. <coughs> and here... All you have to do is you can create some kind of a basic location. We will, um, I'm going to make a new folder specifically for um, requests. Okay. Now, if I go in here, now all I have to do is pull, pull up my Outlook. And I can take any email and just drag it in, drop it, and close. It automatically creates a link to that email. So now you don't have emails and email folders and everything else. You have it right on your to-do list. You simply click open and poof, here's the email. That, that belongs to this request. It is so helpful. This helps me organize myself amazingly. So now, let's say I've just completed something. Now I can simply click the checkbox. And where does it end up? On the completed list. And it sorts it from most recently clicked to last recently clicked. So that's just about everything. If there was an item that you accidentally don't need, that you had it, had it on your to-do list and it doesn't need to be done, just delete, just delete the request and it'll delete the entire line and everything. So that way it doesn't get uh, recorded. Pretty darn simple. Um, this is this is really awesome. I'm pretty excited about it. <laughs> okay, thank you for watching.